we are all set. I'm hoping everything goes good. Today we are going to be doing a lot of anime games. So I'm probably going to do about 45 minutes a piece unless I'm really enjoying it. But today on the playlist we're going to have uh, One Piece Grand Adventure, Naruto Shippuden Ultimate Ninja 4, Digimon Data Squad, World Data Squad, so uh, Dot Hack Infection, Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 2, and Yuasha The Secret of the Cursed Mask. Uh, yeah, I'm going to keep it, you know, uh, I'll, I'll debate if I'm going to do uh, Naruto Ultimate Chronicles 2 or the Storm or Ultimate 4, which one? Uh, Shaman King Power of Spirit. Let's see, I'm also going to do Rocket Power Beach Bandits. I don't know why I threw that in there. I probably won't. <laughs> why not? Uh, that'll probably be the last one. Then we have Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, Capsule Monsters, whatever, you know. So we're going to be playing these about 40 minutes a piece. Maybe 30, 40 minutes an hour. and Depending on how good... I'm, I mean, I've played a lot of them before. I've beat a lot of them. Uh, so it's like... Some of them are really only worth like 20 minutes game time. But we're going to start off with the One Piece Grand Adventure. And we're going to put that in and try to enjoy it because it's going to be good. I've not played this one at all. I actually just bought this about uh, middle of last year sometime. So uh, we'll pick it up and we'll throw the game in. Hopefully it's going to be a fun game and whatnot. So uh, let's go to browse. Exo. Train disc. I'm hoping it actually works. I don't know if it will. Okay, looks. Let's get a look at the memory cards. I, Cause I played this back in um, December for the Ape Escape one. But before that, let's see what else we played. Oh, okay. When was the last time we played Budokai Tenkaichi Two? It says last time I played it was 4-10-2012, which we're gonna play today for the first time since 2012. Uh, yeah, wow, that's crazy. If I would have waited, it would have been actually 10 years. 10 years anniversary for that game. Can you believe it? So long ago. But man, that that's hype. Very nostalgic now, too, because that would have been crazy if I would have waited a couple more months. But, man, almost 10 years. Team and T played that back then. 10 years ago, let's see, that was actually 10 years ago, well, uh, about 6 more days, but Kingdom Hearts 2, 2, 4, wow, it's been 10 years since I played Kingdom Hearts 2, that is crazy, uh, let's see, Dragon Quest 8, 2, 3, wow, that was 10 years ago, well, okay, well, everything's just gonna get older, of course, but man, that's crazy, for, at least for this one, let's, let's check the other memory card real quick before we get started, uh, Come on. Let's see. Uh, okay, we're gonna. This is on the anime list because we're gonna be doing a lot of anime-ish games today. Which 11 4 2016. I think that's when I bought this. I, I didn't think I liked it that much, but we're gonna try to play it. Uh, yeah. Okay. So I tried it a couple times. I know it sucks, but that's why we're only gonna play like 20, 30 minutes. We got a bunch of PS2 games here, anime-ish games, and yeah, we're gonna try to check them all out. We've about 30, 40 minutes a piece. Unless I'm really enjoying one, which this is the first time I'm actually playing this game, and it's One Piece Grand Adventure here. Uh, that's going to be the first time I've ever played this one. I bought this last year. Wow, so we're going to we'll wait for it to lo load up and shit, so we could actually... Okay, volume should be good. <coughs> and we'll get started, because this is going to be good. I mean, I'm not going to start timer now, because it's not when I'm playing, but... We'll wait for it to kick up and have some fun. Hopefully this has a badass entrance, you know, usually these old older anime games had some good intros, usually. And this was also developed by Bandai Namco, let's see who developed it. Uh, it doesn't even show, I'm hoping this works, you know, because like I said this is an older game, I bought it last year, I haven't tried it, so it might not even work. I don't even see the developer here. It's like, I can't even read it. It's like Sophidic. Some other companies. Some random companies. I bet, I bet it'll be pretty good. Hopefully if it even loads. <clears throat> I'm hoping. Because I, I should have tried this when I first got it. And... Wow. 
Well, I'll be. I don't think this is going to load, man. Let's see. That's why you can tell, like, I should have tried this one out because I'm not sure if it's gonna work. It used to be a blockbuster rental, look at that. So, no telling how many times someone played this. Let's see. Wow, okay, whoever. This is an older game. It says 9 1 2006, of September 1st, 2006. Uh, but I don't know if that's when it came out or when, you know. Well, if we look at the back, it, was, it, it could tell it probably goes all the way up to Skype, yeah, which was. Probably around 2005-ish, 2006-ish, but I'm not sure if this is going to load. We'll have to skip straight to the next game, unfortunately. Which the next game will be uh, Naruto Shippuden Ultimate Ninja 4. But I'm hoping that one works because I bought these two at the same exact time. Let's see. And I know my PS2 works because I just bought my PS2. When was it? Like, or I just used it in December, so for Apexcape, so let's see. Unfortunately, this one's not gonna work. I look like an idiot now. Well, that's a shame. The disc doesn't even look that bad. I'm hoping my reader just didn't go kaputs, you know? That would not be fun. Let's try this one out. Let's reset it. That was a big flop already. We'll try this one out. I guess I should have tried some of these before. You know, you always have that. I know one of my games, Sugubi Do Night of a Hundred Frights, that one doesn't work anymore. But uh, with Disc Rot, you never know what games are going to work anymore. Even if you just play it like a year ago, sometimes they just go kaput, unfortunately. This one seemed like it was going to load. Yeah, this one's definitely going to load. Unfortunately, damn, that sucks. I wanted to play this one. I think I paid like 20 bucks for it, which, I mean... I'm a big One Piece fan, but oh well. I'll have to clean it, see if it works. So you have two choices, English and French. Uh, we're going to go English. So... I guess, yeah, I'll have to set the timer when the game starts. Because, like I said, we'll, we'll play a game like every, you know, unless I get bored really bad or or someone wants me to keep playing, but we'll wait for it. Dude, what the hell? So, I'm guessing... Uh, I might have to clean the let's see I have to have one somewhere hmm shit I guess the problem with uh, fucking doing this shit randomly is you should always fucking test drive it to make sure uh, shit. I don't even know last time I had to freaking clean a disc on this man, let's see. I might have to end the stream because it's my PS2. I, I might just have to switch to Super Nintendo and do it that way. Do anime games on that, which I could technically, but uh, poots. Let's see here. What? I'll be right back. I mean, I have to. Well, this was a flop. Let's see. I guess I could do that.
All right, I'm back. I'm going to switch it out. I'm hoping that's the right one. Yeah, that is the right one. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to try to clean these games and hope it's going to work, or the, the laser in here. Because it clearly reads it for a minute, and that's two games. So it has to be the thing, which might as well do it alive, you know. And we'll clean it and try it out and hope it works. You know, I try to be real here, so let's see what's gonna happen. I'm, I'm you know, I'm hoping it's not my PS2 completely because it says it's reading it. So I'm hoping it's gonna work. Dish read error. Shit, it just might be my PS2. Might have finally kaput, man. Because I've had this since 2002, which is very unfortunate. <laughs> oh, not unfortunate. It's very good. It lasted 20 years. I mean, could be a few problems, but I mean, I just played it back in December, so you think it would just spin it, even though. We'll try the other one. It might just be the thing that spins the disc, unfortunately, which... Uh, even if this does not work, uh, at least I can make a video off it. See how big... See how bad it failed and whatnot. See, I'm going to put it in a certain way. Maybe it's just not spinning it. Because even if it doesn't read it, it should be spinning. So... Well, I'll be. It's my freaking uh, dish reader itself, or it's. I don't. I don't think it's speed, spinning it at all because I've used this before. Well, that sucks. I'm just gonna have to re up, uh, refigure things out. Do I have my? I used to have. No, I don't have another PS2 anymore. Uh, then I could just switch out the memory card. Well, the memory cards are still good. I'm just gonna have to get a new PS2. I'll be damned. Hmm. But what I could do, since I put it in a certain way... Well, it spinned it. It had to spin it. So maybe we'll try it now. Maybe it just cleaned off some dust. I don't know. If, if this screwed up, well... I'm just going to switch to Super Nintendo and do some anime games on uh, Game Boy. And... See, it's reading the disc. It's just, I don't know. It's like, hmm. <clears throat> we'll see. Hopefully this works. I don't know. English. This is what we got last time. So I'm hoping it works this time. Please, by the gaming gods, make this work. And I mean, I did buy this one too, so maybe they're just so scratched up it doesn't work anyways. Which I, let me see, a game that I just played not too long, well, or maybe the loading just is terrible. Who knows? Let's end this one. We're gonna try one more game because I'm persistent and uh, and it seems to read it. It's just the other one. It I don't know. Let's let's do uh, Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi two, and the Discord patch crashed up so. Well, let's go system configuration. Let's see what this, you know. Everything seems fine. 
uh, let's see. I guess... Maybe just two games that I bought were flops. Who knows, or maybe... I don't know, let's see. Well, I'll be, it works here. So I bought two games, 40 bucks, and they don't even freaking work. Well, I'll be damned. Fuck. <laughs> I feel ripped off. But shit happens. I mean, I bet if I clean them, they'll work. Well, two games are knocked off right there. And that's one piece, and I got to find a place that cleans them now because I don't want to do them to myself. Did, well, no, this isn't the one I bought. Right, Ultimate Ninja 4. So that's two. I, wow, I, I guess I did buy Ultimate Ninja 4. Yeah, I did. Uh, yeah, those were the two I bought about six months ago, so. Well, that's my fault. I should have tried those out before I just popped it in, but uh, shit happens, I guess. Oh, but now we get a fi our first game finally after 15 freaking minutes of battle and shit. <laughs> but as a new streamer, I will make those mistakes, and now I guess I need to try shit out before I just start going. Man, I used to play this game for hours. We I used to actually play uh, Budokai 3 a lot more back 20 2009. I know it's still light, man, but. Still have some buddies in high school. We still love this game, man. Back then, you know, good 12 years ago, we'd play this all the freaking time. It was fun. I'm just hoping I have the right memory card in here because I want to have all the characters. Which I have two in there, so I have a good chance that I have Dragon at least. Take Let's, give it our best shot. Let's continue. Let's see where we are. Okay, go. All right. I'll give it my there's also an Let's see. Game. You'll have a lot more fun in it. You can create your own custom. You can create your own custom chair. If you equip Z items, you can really become stronger in a hurry. You can learn how to. Now it's time to test. Let's just do one v one to see. Get me accustomed to it again. And it's been so long since I've played. I'll just do single battle. I guess we should start the timer now, but I, I guess we've eliminated an hour automatically right there with two games being a failure. I'll start with 40 minutes, let's see. So we have several games to go through. Uh, let's see, who should I go with? What the? Looks like I don't have everyone. Why wouldn't it read, like, Memory Car 2, though? I'm pretty sure I had everyone. Okay, I guess we'll just work with what we have. Oh, I guess, okay. Let's see, who should I go with? Frieza first form. Let's see. Who should I go with? Let's go with Vegeta Scouter. Let's just go random. Okay. Let's just do random. Man, uh, yeah, like I said, I had so much trouble with two games, which, you know, I guess they don't work anymore. These two, which I just bought at, at freaking 20 bucks a piece about six months ago. Uh, well, I'm kind of glad it's that, not my PS2, because I don't know. I, I think if I clean those games, I, they will work, but... Uh, we got about, like, six more uh, anime games to go through, so we'll see. If people want me to switch up sooner or later, or whatever the case may be, we can. But it's been so long since i played this. If you were here at the beginning, which I don't think anyone was, I looked at the memory card. It's been almost ten years since i played this one, so... Is pretty crazy. Ten years. If I, well, it happened in April. It said the memory card. The last time I played it was April. So, but that was on memory card too. So I don't know why it didn't uh, save. Oh 
Come on. Oh, I guess he is stronger because I'm only the scatter one, right? I forgot, this one actually took uh, some good time to get good at because you actually had to... You actually had to, like... And it was very skilled, or not skilled, but it was, like, if you're early Vegeta, you're not going to do good against uh, later Vegeta or something like that, you know? The scaling in the game is different. I do not remember the controls at all. Damn, lost my first match in 10 years, man. That's not good. We'll fight again, just to see. And then we might as well do the story because, you know, since I apparently don't have the right memory card in there, or at least it only reads the from slot one, unfortunately. So. It's been a long time, Dodoria. Vegeta, why you? Man, some of my favorite DBZ characters, I'd say I do like Vegeta, but um, let's see who else do I like? Uh, not good enough to say. Ah, oh, come on. It's been a long time since I've seen DBZ2. I think the last time I actually sat down and watched it was like 20... 2010, maybe? So it's been about 12 years. So I was very really big back into it. Like I said, me and my buddy, we will come home weekends, you know, we'll, our summer breaks, we'll go to the local gas station, get a few slushies. Have a fun time playing this. See, I'm doing like no damage to him. I need to figure that out ASAP. Damn, I'm just getting wrecked. Took out one bar. Shit. I'm getting wrecked. Alright, we'll go to the store for a bit till time's up and then just. Oh, damn it. Let's see, look at. Oh, skill list, let's see. Oh, wow. Or two galactic gun. I get. Oh, that's right, you have to unlock the moves. Shit, no wonder I'm doing. Like, really bad. Return to main menu. Let's just do the story for a while. Okay, Gohan. You can fight in a tournament. All right. I'll give it my all in this ranking challenge. <laughs> Let's 
do this. Long I remember ago. this being some fun. Seven magic dragon balls were forged that when gathered together would summon a dragon to grant a wish. This is the story of those whose lives were touched by the dragon ball. So after Dragon Ball Tenkaichi, we got, I don't know if I'm going to play that one, we got some Dot Hack Infection, we'll play that for like 30 minutes. And then we got some Inuyasha on the upper back burner, Secrets of the Cursed Mask. So if you guys are interested in that, but we also have several other games as well. Unfortunately, we had two that didn't go as planned, so. So, our, let me actually check some. Yeah, we get it. Kakarot. Okay. Let's let's try to upload the memory if we can. There has to be a way. Let's go to. There has to be something, you know. Well, you can learn a lot about the Dragon Ball Z. It's a history textbook. You can listen. You can read it. You can set options. Let's check options. You can save the various settings. Choose wisely. There we go. You can save and load game data. Stay off it. You can load game data. You can load game data. Put a PlayStation 2 memory card in the slot and save the game data. Okay. I think the second one is what I need to do. So let's do data load. Yes, that's fine. What the fuck? Fuck you. Clearly there was one in the beginning. You can save sure. <laughs> Reset it. Let's just see. Let's see, uh, browse. Okay, so it was there. A-holes. Why well, didn't read it? Unless I have more than one. Let's look at the second one as well, just in case, but... Let's see... Okay, so the first, okay, we, we got them right now. I'm hoping this is going to work. Man, I'm making this look like I've never touched a game system or anything or <laughs> in my life. But, oh man. That, Grant, like I said, as you could, well, if you looked at the memory cards, it took like 10, you know, it's been like 10 years since I've truly played the PS2, like, religiously. But... It is one of my favorite systems, you know. It still is. Okay, load successfully. Okay, so it's Developed by Spike, never heard of them. So deck, soft deck, ADX. That's probably the engine they used, I don't know. God, I want to relaunch that, but we have to. The clock's ticking. Dragon Balls, it's a challenge, Kakarot! Exo, we have victory. Let's see how many characters we actually have now. We have to have at least all of them now, hopefully. I'm here to test everyone's abilities. Battle, that's fine. Dude, what the fuck? How come? Oh my god, what the hell? 
Where's everyone, man? I know we've had, dude. We... Unless I, dude, I used to have so many memory cards. I could, it just could be um, like this one could have been a random one. I guess we have to do Dragon Adventure again, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah, okay, as you can tell. I I apparently restarted or I let someone else play. So I, this isn't my original memory card apparently. I forget you could play with the load menu, which was cool. What the hell? If you defeat an enemy with a higher level than you, you can gain experience. <laughs> okay, let's see. So am I supposed to fight him? What's that? Oh my gosh, stop. <laughs> fly fast. So, you actually came. How surprising. You know why I'm here. Give me back my son. I'm done trying to get Dude, man, the PS2 still holds up because of the cell shaded graphics, man. It still looks pretty you good, decent, you know? It doesn't look like it aged pretty well in a lot of games, you know? You can do that and pick a little. Not much choice, right? Hoping I win this. I'm gonna look really bad. Technically, I did. He did get wrecked in the show, but still. <laughs> I forget this one is harder than like Budokai was, or just regular Budokai's. I don't think I did enough damage <laughs> to even do much. I should have put on easy. It's like doing nothing to him. You suck, Piccolo. <laughs> oh my god. 
Did, like no damage. <laughs> okay, I think I got it this time. Let's see. Uh, we kind of just have to keep trying till we get it. So Goku could do some damage, but Piccolo is just as bad. <laughs> I, I grant I'm the bad one because I don't know the controls as much as I used to, but... Ready? Fight! Oh my gosh. Took out a whole bar right there. Bitch. Oh my gosh. Dude, he is relentless. A new There we go, I'm getting the hang of it now. I don't know if I'm gonna be in this one because I'm still being wrecked, kind of. So relentless.
Oh my gosh, I still could do it. He doesn't stop. Oh, shit. I was close that time though. I think I got it next this time though. <clears throat> then I'll be able to be better because I get the timing and stuff now. Not bad after 10 years of not playing. Man, yeah, but man, that's crazy. Ten year younger me could definitely wreck me in almost any game. <clears throat> no doubt about it. So, hey, Bio, what's going on, man? We're playing a bunch of anime PS2 games, but I found out two PS game, PS2 games that I was gonna play earlier. Both of them fuck. Like they're, you know, I bought them like six months ago, and they they don't work. <laughs> you know How's it going, man? Hope you're doing good. You so um, I, we got several more to play. We got Inuyasha, Dot Hack, Digimon World, Data Squad, Shaman King, Yu-Gi-Oh Capsule, and a, few, a couple others. But it's been ten years since I played this one, so I'm doing terrible. <laughs> you know any uh, good... Oh yeah, it happens. I mean, I should have tested because if I looked like a complete idiot in the beginning of the screen. Because I tried both of the... I thought it was my PS2 in the beginning, but found out it was just two games that were bad. But uh, Do you know like any good... Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, it was the... Here, let me put it on pause. It was the uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Capsule... Coliseum, which I, you know, this was one of my first, uh, you, like, uh, earlier games I got, and it's a fun game. I, I like it, but it's been a long time since I played it, probably like 2006 or so, but. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I've been slacking on my PS2 games and playing them lately. I need to get back to it. Do you know any good, like, really good anime uh, PS2 games? The Capsule Monster game is pretty good. It has an underrated soundtrack. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah I, I believe it. Let's see. I'll shoot. Oh. I need to get Gungrave, the PS2 Gungrave game. I know there's one out there. How, I'm, I've never played it though, but it's one of my favorite anime series. And I'm excited for the one that's coming out this year. Uh, I will get that one, but... Oh, Ghost in a Shell? Okay. I'll have to definitely check that one out. In fact, it's one of the games that I'm trying to... Oh, no, man, I'll, I'll, try, I'll definitely hit you up for it if, if you want, man. I'll definitely uh, take it. How, how much you have? Well, I mean, we, if I could add you on Twitter, we could get that situated or whatever, or however you want to do it, man. Because I'll definitely take it. Oh, my gosh.
Oh yeah, yeah, sounds good, man. I'll definitely take it. I'll, I'll hit you up on like Twitter or whatever you use. And I don't really have a dis. I mean, I shoot great ones, but I really don't. I don't know. I'll figure it out. But dang, I was hoping to get in that time. I did worse than last time. I never played the first Gungrave, but the second game is all right. I'm. But I just don't feel like I need it in my. Oh, yeah, you, are you just like downgrading a lot of your collection? Like, realistically, I haven't really bought many games for the collection, you know, because like I'm going more PC gaming, like for modern stuff, so it's like, I don't know. And I do want to get into more emulation, you know, for some stuff, because some games I refuse to pay like outlandish prices for. But, uh, I'm just kind of, you know, like the old days of like emulation, it was like so risky for. Malware and spyware and viruses and trojans and stuff. So I'm still kind of iffy on it, but. You know why I'm here. Give me back my son. Yeah, yeah. I. You are just. Yeah, I, let me see. Like maybe I bought like ten retro games in the past couple of years, a few years, you know. So it's like I'm definitely down, like not already downgrading, but I I just don't like to sell the stuff I have. But I'm not gonna go out of my way to get more games if that makes sense. Especially, I don't know, I'm more cheap now too, so it's like 20, 30 bucks is like my, you know, depending on the game, but. Let's see, I'm gonna try to be in this time. Oh, you have, uh, you never have to worry about viruses on ROM sites anymore. That's such a mid-2000s. Okay. Yeah, that's what, I, I had a buddy, me and him were hanging out at a barcade we went to yesterday, and he pretty much told me the same thing, so. Uh, but my thing is I'm only keeping the games that are super special. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. That's the way it should be. I mean... Much as I love the anime for Magic Knight, oh uh, yeah, Ray Earth, I was okay with selling the game since I'm just selling my North. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't even have a Saturn, but yeah, some of those are really high. But yeah, it's like if you have the good memories and stuff, and you know you've played it for whatever. You know, it's like how many more times are you gonna play it, or you know you gotta have the memory. Sometimes having the memories are better than having the product. Oh, damn grab. Oh. Okay, I'm still alive. Okay. Uh, oh, no, I'm not. It's time for me to stay. Much like, of course, I'm keeping my. De oh yeah, deception and 
all the ones I grew up owning for you. Yeah, I agree. Those are the ones I definitely will keep. So, you don't have like a new gaming console like PS5, uh, Xbox, whatever it's called, and uh, whatnot, do you? Because like I said, I, I didn't get one, so I'm just kind of like sticking mainly to like PC gaming for when I want, really want to play, play something new or... Because, I mean, I have a okay laptop that could play pretty much like a... I think it's like a 2800 or whatever, whatever, I, you know, I'm... Uh, so it could play pretty much all the new stuff that comes out, but it's like... I don't see buying like a... A brand new system. And, I, you know, which I wanted to buy one for like Lost Judgment, but then it can't... It, I was worried it wasn't going to play good on the PS4, but it was playing just fine, so... No, I don't own the new console. Honestly, I don't see a point with getting. Yeah, I, yeah, I agree. I don't see it either, man. I remember like when uh, every like when the PS4 came out, and they were really going like cutting out uh, manuals and stuff, and people were really mad about it. But now they really don't even care anymore. But I still kind of like I still wish they had manuals, you know. But, but it's now like, even when you buy a physical brand new game, it's like, it's just a, like a digital key, pretty much, just that you need, you know, it's weird. Dude, no, stupid. That's BS. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let me see how much time do I have. I was only playing like each game for like 30, 40 minutes. I got like five minutes left. I'll try one more time. Manures are cool, but I feel like they should only include it if they can make it look nice. With oh yeah. Like when they got cheap with the cheap like gray ones, I was like, that's stupid anyways. At that point, you might as well not even do it, you know? <laughs> so yeah, I agree with that. Yeah, so. Gonna be able to do one more and then we'll switch to like, we'll do uh, the Yu-Gi-Oh! one or so, why not, yeah, because all of them are like JRPGs, so it's like, you know I don't know, I might do the same for PS3, I got quite a bit of anime games. Where some game manuals are just bland unless... Oh yeah, yeah, that's stupid. There's there's absolutely no point to include it then, you know? Absolutely no point. I don't know, I'm working on a video right now, slowly but surely, where I'm doing like gaming pro... Like, my favorite gaming protagonist, but... It's like slowly coming along. I, I'm like planning stages of it because it's hard. I'm trying to make it so there's like no anime characters or anything that's like has their own form of media. It has to be like strictly gaming, so it can't be like it couldn't be like any from anyone from anime game or something like that. So like I don't even say like. A lot of characters from Smash would even fit. Well, they have to have their own game and stuff, so. Another good PS2 game, I don't know if you have it, but it's a game based after the singer Gat called Boonji Gat. Okay, I think I've heard, seen, heard of it. Let me look it up real quick. Boonji Gat. I know a couple for that. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Boon Jin Guy. Okay. okay, I don't know that game. Okay. Oh, okay, the cover's different here than it is in Europe and stuff. It does look familiar, but. You no, know, I've actually never played it, I don't own it. I'll definitely have to check that one out. I'll put that on my list. Bungie Guy, The Forsaken City. But, yeah, it looks pretty cool. I like it. It's made by, or developed by Taito, or published by BAM, right? If that's it. 
Yeah, I'll have to check that out. It's a hack and slash, and it's okay. I do, yeah, I definitely like a lot of hack and slashes. I still need to, like, the Onimusha, I own the first one, right? I own the third one and Dawn of Memories. I, I still never played the second one. Because I just, I don't know, Unimusha was one of those games you saw everywhere, you know, even, like, at every, well, at least around my area. So I'll be like, I'll pick it up, I'll pick it up next time, I just never did, you know? And now, it's probably, I don't know if it's hard to find, I just don't go looking for it, but, you know. Oh my gosh, he's, like, so much more aggressive than last time. Yeah, I definitely added to my list. Apparently not, because you are kicking my ass every time and get more aggressive. Onimusha is great, I only played the first two. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, so. Yeah, the only reason, I mean, back, you know, back in the day, they had cover art and stuff, and on the third one they had uh, the actor that played in The Professional, uh, Leon The Professional, and that's what, I, I actually played the third one before I played the first one, because I, I was like, I wanted to, you know, that was like, Earlier, before they, well, they had did some actors and stuff in movies, but, you know, Gene Reno was a pretty good actor, and I liked him. Very underrated French actor, but. about that Sully that is going to make the game hard to get a re oh yeah because of licensing and stuff yeah yeah that probably would make it harder yeah I, in a way I, I, was, I always thought that was a cool idea like back in the day having actors and stuff but for example they just had lost judgment you know for the um, PlayStation oh PlayStation part of the real go 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 Yakuza series in a way and you know, the, they already had trouble getting the that because they didn't want any of the games coming to PC, you know, because they were going to, because of the studio that hired the actor that played in Lost Ju or Judgment didn't want to be, you know, the agent company didn't want his rights to be on PC or so. I don't know, it's weird. So when you have actors and stuff, it makes everything way more complicated, uh, than, especially Japanese and probably foreign actors and stuff. I'm not sure how it be, like, American actors, but I know Japanese actors are a lot more strict about that and talent and stuff, so Alright, man, we're gonna switch to the next game because I'm getting my ass kicked I don't think I don't think I I got so close one time, but he somehow he kept getting harder <laughs> Okay, let's see Get to that one Let's see that one. <clears throat> Let's see. Oh shoot, shoot, browse. I should. I might have the memory card that I played it originally on, but I guess it's a story-driven game, so. Oh, okay, there it is. Yes. When was the last time I played this? 2011, 27, 2009. So that was the last time I played it. But let's start this out. <clears throat> good old... Oh, yeah, man. I'm, I'm, Dude, I'm surprised how good the Eternal mem like clock is on the PS2. Because I looked at the date earlier. And it was still... It was accurate. Well, I'm not sure about that time but the date was accurate so I'm, I'm surprised how how good the internal memory is at least on that
Let's watch intro. Oh, yeah, because intro... All these good, an like, older anime games have good, pretty good intros, you know? But... Yami Yugi, Yami Bakura. Man, yeah, I used to love playing the Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG game a lot, but I stopped around 2019. My PS2 clock is off because I had to set it to 2030 to beat a boss in... Oh, Mender Gear... Oh, yeah, that... You did that? <laughs> yeah. I would imagine. Yeah, that's crazy. That's funny. I remember, I don't know about Windows 11 or 10 or maybe 7, I don't know, but I forget, maybe it was Windows XP or Vista, I think it was Vista, where is if the time wasn't right, like if it was beyond the time you could get on the internet, which was weird, uh, because I, I, I forget it, because mine was, or it was like old or something, I don't know, because I tried, I, I used one of my old laptops just to see, what, like I was looking at the configurations and all this stuff, and... I was trying to get online, and, it's, and it wouldn't work because the time, like, the, the clock was off. And I was like, what the hell, what's that have to do with anyway? Uh, well, let's just go campaign mode, I guess, and I don't mind starting from the beginning, or I wonder where I'm at. I think it's going to start me off from the beginning anyway. I like the card game, but I hate the meta. Oh, yeah, man, the meta, it's, like, way worse than, like, I think it was good to, like, they did the links and pen, like pendulum was when it started to get crazy but uh, yeah it, it gets crazy and it's like well I mean it's Konami so it's like play to win you, or pay to win you know and while a lot of card games are like that magic Pokemon all that stuff I played pretty much all of them I still love them but it's like it's just a spit a cost expensive I don't I don't like to do you know Man, I don't know. Like I said, I like a lot, a lot of the original stuff. Anyways, Z's is where I left. Or I, yeah, left. Like it was starting to get bad. Yeah, it was starting to get bad. I, I got back into it. Like I played 2002 pretty much till 2007, eight ish around there. Then I stopped till like 2013. I got back into it till like 20. 17 then I just kind of stopped again and I, I still buy cards every once in a while because the artwork is still amazing But even though if the cards are useless the artwork is still pretty nice to have and put in books, I guess, but uh, I don't know. I played that new Digimon card game CCG that came out uh, last, uh, 2020 November 2020 and it's pretty fun, but you know card games are just uh, Enter name. Let's see. Okay. Shit, what should I name this? Hmm. Let's see, what should I name it? Hmm. After that, just get stupid, and yet I still play Master Duel. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's the new one that just came out, alright? Digimon has a new card game. Oh, yeah, it, the card game is actually pretty fun. It's pretty balanced, you know, honestly, well, last time I played, I played against the meta deck, and I actually won, and I, I, I you know, I just played budget stuff, so, it, you can pull off wins if you know what you're doing, and it's not bad. Name him Kaiba Fan, okay, I'll do that, yeah. <laughs> Let's see, Kaiba Fanboy, I guess I'll do proper grammar. <laughs> See, where's a space? Uh, can I do a space? Uh, space boy over there. Yeah, kind of a fanboy. <laughs> Let's see, fanboy. I honestly do like Kaiba way more than uh, Yugi. <laughs> Let's see. Oh shoot! I oh, okay. Your name will be used for saved data. Oh, okay, yeah, that's fine. If I remember right, you're you're just renaming. Oh, okay, yeah. 
okay. Uh, for a quick start, play with the preset setting by selecting purchase, start, rebuild, select, fill. Uh, for now, since we're on like kind of like a timeline, I'll just do the custom, I guess. I didn't set the timer, but you know, it's not too much of a big. Kaiba has some of the most to. Oh yeah, he does. You know, I, I really like a lot of four kids, like early and like dubs. You know, I don't care what a lot. You know, I mean, a lot back then, mo those people didn't know that there was subbed and dub. You know, a lot of them did. I know some some people did, but a lot of people didn't. I knew you wouldn't have prepared anything. And I like with a lot of these games, they actually kept the voice actors. You know, like a lot of them, they got the four kids cast usually, which is cool. That's my grandpa. Oh, your horses. I never said I was giving you these for free. I'll exchange them for monster monster points. You can earn monster points by winning during the tournament. Keep ah, I see. Oh shoot. Let me give you some tips. Monsters can be separated into light, dark, fire. In other words, each monster has a Attributes. It's always about attributes and almost everything, isn't it? Are you ready? Oh my it's gonna do the whole thing. We're gonna try to speed it up a little bit. I wish Duelist for the Roses Castle. Oh yeah, yeah, that's the PS1, right? I think that's the PS1, right? Yeah, that would have been cool too. The Duelist of Roses. Oh no, that's the PS2 one. What was the PS1 one? Wasn't there one for PS1? Wind is strong against water, and thunder is Oh, okay, it's also P okay. They have okay. Yeah. So, did you like collect the cards when you like? Did you get back into like 2002 when it first came to NA, or did you like get into it later or whatever? And I tell you, the only time in my area we had to go like to the local gas station to get it. Like we can't like Walmart didn't even have it. So I don't know how the local gas station found out about it. The PS1 game is for okay. The PS1 is for vivid memories. Okay. That's my grandson. So I was like, I was surprised because all the like, like early elementary, like I was like, oh, where'd you get these cars? They'd be like, oh, what's at the gas station? I'm like, how did the gas station know to get that However, stuff? You know, you that makes no sense. Well, and I, they didn't have that like Walmart or any. Well, they I might understand. have that like Tours R Us and stuff, but the game could have been awesome. But the grinding in that game is the oh, okay, I believe it. Let's see, select the starter kit for purchase. Uh... Shit, I'm... I'm gonna go with... Dark. Oh, uh, no, no. Because if, if I recall... That's gonna be grind, like, you know? Well, I guess I'm only... Let's see... Uh, that's probably the generic one, you know, they expect you to choose a light one, right? I bet most people chose fire. I, I bet, you know, just, uh... Oh, yeah, fire? Okay. Yeah, I'll pick fire. Kamikaze. Like, I bet on a psychological level, like, if most people played this, they would either choose fire or light, or dark, you know, those are the top three. I bet a lot of other ones get, like, passed over. Okay, area one. Man, I tell you, yeah, like, uh, uh, man, Faye Val- or not Faye Valentine, uh, My Valentine, the waifu material. <laughs> if I remember, the fire one is for okay for the better ones to start with. The dark is hard. Oh, okay, the dark. Yeah, because I was thinking dark would probably be like the final bosses stuff too, because that'd be like a mirror match or something. Yeah, I would imagine. Hi, you. I 
I'm trying to remember what I would have picked the last time, or what I did pick the last time. Joel. Curious what 13 year old or 13 years ago me would have chose or whatever. The one and only. And don't think I'm gonna take it hey, easy. And my Valentine. Oh yeah, <laughs> both of them. <laughs> both of them wife I'm and not material. holding anything back. Then let's get started, Joey. I honestly always do like uh, Harpy Ladies as like a deck idea, and Amazon is full of them were pretty cool deck ideas. But in like the real game, I mean Harpies did good for a while, I guess. But let's see which one you can choose. Three. Okay, I'm gonna go attack first. When I first played, I picked dark since most of my favorite tend to be. Oh yeah, yeah. Like a lot of them would be like uh, some skull, dark magician. I would imagine uh, later on, right? Okay. I'll select. Wait a sec. What's wrong, Yugi? There's a limit on which monsters you can use, which is determined by monster. <coughs> you mean the points I pick in order to get monsters? Oh, did you ever play a? Uh... Project X Zone on 3DS, cause uh, speak like strategy games like this, you know. I, I, man, that game was such a cool like fan. I you know like it was like a fan made game because everyone wanted to see something like that. I played it. I got pretty far into it, and then I freaking spent 40 matches on one match, and I fucking died on it. I got so pissed. I almost broke my 3DS, man, because then I had to start all over, you know. And I usually don't rage quit. Like, there's very few games I will rage quit. Skull Knight is my all-time favorite card. Oh, okay, Skull Knight. Yeah, he's pretty you badass. Can point, then I can use ten monsters that are ten But like, uh, when I play each. games like this or strategy or games, and they take like forty minutes a game or longer, points each. And then when I lose, that's that's when I rage quit. You know, or that's get right. mad. <laughs> so you have to think carefully about the balance of which monsters to use. Okay, thanks, Yumi. Okay, I think I did choose fire because of all these guys. I think these are. Let's see. Oh, okay. Well, okay. Hmm. I get 270, so I could 45, 45, 50. I mean, easy enough. You probably could just do the. Yes, I played Project A so It's all right, but the concept is fantastic. Yeah, yeah. I think they need to make a beat em up. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. A beat em up. That would have been cool. Beat em up or fight or something, you know, something like that. Uh, but there's so many fighters now, you know, that come out. Like, they get, like, so many get passed under the radar by a lot of people. And it's a shame, like, uh, what was that one with Nitro Blasters? It wasn't that great of a fighter game, but uh, it was it was a fun idea. Let's see. I guess I'll go for like the limited ones, you know, because if I have more, I just uh, I don't have to play as smart if I have more, you know. Usually, or if they do another tactics game, they need to make the combat more exciting. Oh yeah, yeah, they do. I, like I say, I'm not even that big. Like I like some tactic games, but like you have to be like prepared to play them, you know, for at least for me, uh, because I'm bad at them, usually. Even though I like games like Risk and Chess and stuff, it's just like... Yes, okay, let's look at the whole map, I forget, okay, so they're right here. That's just, uh, that's like blocked off, so it's like, you only have like, you could come around and go that way, but it's like, you really don't have much choices, right? Oh, shit. Oh, no, I won't. I thought that was the monsters. Uh, manual place. Let's do manual. Yeah, I have to be in the right mood. Yeah, exactly. I meant to put the monsters here. I wasn't paying attention to that. Oh, well. I guess that's fine. But...
like the Shaman King. I, I know I beat that one too, the Shaman King Power Spirit one. I, I played that one uh, several years ago, and I definitely fully played through that one. It was it was super easy, and it's like when you uh, get in a battle, it's like a fighting game in a way. So it, they added a little bit to that. Uh, but yeah, I, I like Shaman King the series anyway, so. So it's like if there's an anime based off it or something that I'm already interested in, it makes it a lot easier, of course, but... It's time to start! Okay... Hey! In order to move your pieces, you need AP! I see. Each piece has a set requirement of AP. And if I move it, then the AP... Yep! Then you can't move your pieces any... So, I have to be uh, so are you gonna, uh, AP. are you gonna start, like, cosplaying any, like, are going to conventions this year, uh, Bio? From what I played of the Shaman King game, it seems cool, but I think Soul Calibur 3 did bet, er, uh, did that concept. Oh, yeah, yeah, exactly. When thinking about how to move my pieces. Uh-huh, but first... You can't move anything... If you don't summon monsters from your capsules. So you have to choose which monsters to summon. You're right. Okay. I don't want to waste a move that yet. So let's just, uh... Oh, you have to hatch him first. I forgot about that. I guess I just explained that, but... I hope so. Canada is kind of weird about event outings, so I have to wait. Oh, yeah, that's okay, yeah. Yeah, I would imagine. Um, I mean, even depending on where you go, like here in the States, like some places are very strict about it, and then some places are, like, really relaxed uh, about it. And where I live, they're really relaxed, but if you go to, like, the next state over, they're, like, tight about it, or... But if you go down to Texas, no well, one really fine. cares at all. It, it's weird here. So. I went down to, like, Georgia, which is, like, several states away from me, like, last year. And you had to wear the mask all Which I'm fine wearing the mask. I'll wear the mask. But, uh, it's like, and you need to be vaccinated and all that stuff. And you have to do everything. But, uh, here I go. some places it doesn't matter. They won't let you do anything anyway, so. Hey! What? Where it says AP on the screen, there's a number with a plus sign next to it. Yes. This number must be the amount of AP that increases on my turn. But yes, I wish I could go to one this year. I miss... Oh, yeah, I imagine. What's, like, the biggest uh, yeah. convention near you? you? Like, monster, are increase. you close to, like, Anime North, or are you, like, further away from that one? Or, or Grant, I actually like going to, like, medium-sized cons to smaller cons, because I've been to, like, really big conventions now. And it's like, you're so freaking spread far apart from stuff, and it's like... And then you have to wait in lines, so it's like, I kind of technically like the smaller to medium-sized conventions that now. Either I so. move a summon, or I summon so that I can... That's something I need to think about. It's important to make a decision... It's like, I, if I wanted to stay in line, I'll go to, like, Disney World and stay in line for, like, two hours. And, and whatnot. <laughs> And then sometimes you stand, stand in line for those big conventions, you still can't even get in, so... I've been to Anime North once, it was cool, but my favorite was, uh, YetiCon. It took place at it. Oh, okay. That sounds cool. Yeah. I like to go a little bit slower. I mean, I'm probably. I mean, this is just a that terrain is favorable test game for your pieces attribute. If the terrain is fit, but if it's unfavorable, then the ability decreases, right? Yeah, you can check by looking at your pieces. I see. Oh, duh, he's fire. So I should be on the same terrain as my attribute as much. It check, but it's worth remembering. No, he's a win. Let's see. Okay. 
Oh, <laughs> yeah. I know, right? The tutorials are sometimes like too long, but I, I can understand if like you never played any. Like you know, I guess when I was like super young, I, I probably didn't pay attention when I was super young. You know, honestly, I think I'm out of. I forget if this thing could actually attack, but I'll just kind of keep it. So do you do you actually like keep up with like a lot of voice actors and what they do? Like I I tr I don't as much anymore. Like I knew like a lot of poor kids act like voice actors, but like I haven't like like newer dub actors or even sub actors. I try not. I don't know. I I just kind of like the. Uh, the mystery, I don't know, mystery about it is like, I kind of like to keep things like in the realm of fake, you know, of like, oh, <laughs> I don't know, it's weird, but let's see, let's get you up there, and I, yeah, yeah, it depends on who it is. Hey, reaction. Uh, it's it is Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, Capsule Monster Coliseum. It's a tactical JRPG based on Yu-Gi-Oh. It's a PS2 game, of course. I mostly just to see what other roles they've done. Oh yeah, yeah. That's the best way to. Do. Yeah. Yeah, that's 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 a good way to do. But yeah, that's the game I'm playing right now. It's of course developed by Konami and whatnot. So it's a it's a fun game. I, I really enjoy it. Underrated, you know, OCT is Bio said, which I, I you know I honestly haven't heard of it since uh what I haven't heard it in about nine years. But <laughs> uh, let's see. I have to figure out and we well, in turn and let them make their move. Have you okay? So reaction, man. How you doing today? I hope you're doing great. Oh, awesome! Thank you. Yeah, we definitely play a lot of different games here: JRPGs, tactical games. Uh, yeah, exactly. Yeah, I, I would agree with that. Bio. Uh, I pretty much play everything, you know. Uh, I play retro to modern, all that stuff and whatnot. So, uh, yeah, I hope you're doing good. Reaction. That's great. Also, just to tell you, my like uh, streams like there's like 15 sec, 10 to 15 second delay from like when you comment to probably when I reply. You know, I don't have the best internet connection. Uh, I really haven't played Minecraft or Roblox or any. Uh, I played Minecraft way back in the day for like when it was only on PC back in the day, but. Uh, I have not really played uh, any of that, so I've, I, I've heard of Roblox, but I've never played it. I'm kind of a, a millennial boomer. <laughs> That's probably the best way to explain it. That's probably the best way to explain me, man. A millennial boomer. <laughs> Okay, I could make my first attack, but then he should be able to attack me next time, huh? Oh yeah? That's cool. Let's see, let's attack. Exol! Yeah, no, I'm not saying they're bad games. I actually, like, I play, like, Minecraft, like, once, so, I mean... It's all. It's not. I'm not saying it's a bad game or anything. It's not my really probably cup of tea or my kind of hamburger, but I like. But I do like playing with Legos. So I guess you could say those are kind of like the same thing. You build stuff with it. But. Hey, uh, I'm not sure, uh, Bio, if you remember. 
Oh, what, my subscriber goal, I couldn't care less about my subscriber goal, man. I've been doing YouTube for, honestly, a, quite a while. Like, since, like, 2011, on and off. Just, I do, I like to create stuff, I like to make videos, I like to talk with people, whatnot. Uh, you know, so I'm not, like, really, or that was bad. Uh, I don't know. I'm not, like, I, I'd rather talk to people and stuff, you know? And hang out. And like say, I, I work a job, so I'm, I mean, like, I'm, like, Sunday through Tuesday, I probably won't try. Oh, no, you don't, you don't have to react. Uh, let's see, bio. Yeah, just do it for fun. It's always, yeah, I agree, man. Like, if, honestly, if I did keep up with it, like, 2010, 2011, I probably could have been a lot more, but, you know, I probably would have been canceled by now because I kind of have a mouth on me, so I would have been canceled. <laughs> Especially back I then. So. You. Let's see. Who else can I move? I think I moved everyone besides Scorpion, right? Or am I just out of... Let's see, I'm trying. Let's see. I ain't gonna lose. All right, man. Have, uh, let's see. He's gonna do some damage to me this turn, probably. Then let's get started, Joey. Exhaust, Joey. Man, Bio, do you actually? Uh, I forget if you actually like uh, speak. Uh... Okay, Bio. Yeah, it makes me wonder where I'd be if I started doing what I do back in 2007. But no, instead I was making Microsoft same. Oh, yeah, yeah, man. I think you would have been like you would have probably been like the 20, 30, 40,000, maybe 100,000 subscriber. You really have good content, man. You actually put stuff like you put uh, work into your videos. Unlike me, like when I make videos, I'm lazy and I I don't really like to edit stuff as much, you know. Which is, I don't know why I didn't start shrinking sooner, you know, but, uh, I don't know. You're I just, I'm so inconsistent too, because I like to talk about, like, everything, like, like, games, anime, Lego, you know, so I know what, like, if you want to stick to, like, the algorithm, the algorithmic YouTube thing, you have to stick to, like, one dedicated topic, and yeah, that's probably not good for me, because that'd be boring for me. Oh shit, I lost my first duck. You were doing better than I And there's more where that came. I'm just getting warmed up, Yugi. Yeah. I'll use all my skills until yeah, the end what, the yeah, it happens, but oh well, I'm more than happy with what I've got going. Yeah, yeah, I agree, man, because, you know, I've seen some YouTubers, like, uh, I don't really want to say their name, but, like, they had, like, a lot of subscribers early on, but then they stopped. And, like, they probably would be up at, like, one million, but you could tell that a lot of people don't like attention. I know, like, uh, a few people that they really could have done something or they, they're actually really big in the community I guess they are but they they don't want to make content because they're like too camera shy or whatnot and which is you know that's fine but oh awesome welcome back reaction man you're not gonna let up not even a little bit are you Oh, okay. Thanks. I... Huh. 
I know some people tend to get busy with stuff. Oh yeah, yeah, with outside of YouTube, yeah. Yeah, mainly, like, I'm not sure, like, I'm trying to stay consistent now with, like, streaming and stuff, but in, like, a couple weeks, I'll, I, who knows, I'll probably vanish again for, like, another eight months. <laughs> you know, that's, you know, I've been doing that for years. Like, I'll, I'll make content for, like, a month or two, and then I'll be like, yep, yeah, I'm out. <laughs> Just because, yeah, I don't know, like, I like to sleep and relax on my off days, but... <laughs> Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, man. Thank you, reaction. I gotta make my move now. Uh, even if he takes out this one, he'll be a goner next turn, I think. I guess. Thank Man, you. <laughs> you're not gonna let up. But uh, let's see. Let's try to take out these guys. Well, I know that they'll probably take out one more guy of my guy, or at least get half my damage down. But. If, if if I was really bad, I would lose somehow on this, but I'm not that bad. I'll, I'll probably lose much later down in the game, but... Uh, well, in turn... Yeah, yeah, he might take out one more of my guys, but that's about it. What is that? Um, Omeneru Shinru or something like that. Uh, you are already dead. <laughs> I forget. Oh, mate, I forget how to say it. Uh, for uh, Fist of the North Star. <laughs> I, that's funny how he tried to like escape a little bit. Okay, I was about to say, if he didn't at least, like, take out, like, one of them, that would have been stupid if he would have attacked someone else. <laughs> Nani? <laughs> Man, I'm trying to actually, like, really, well, I've been, like, slowly studying Japanese for, like, the past, since, like, 2017, slowly, like, I'll, I'll take, like, a lesson, like, once a month. <laughs> So it's like, I'm never going to actually accomplish learning it, but... <laughs> I mean, it's been a while since I've, like, sat down and read any uh, kanji or anything like that, but... I would really love to get to the point where I could be, like, in JPLT 3 or 2 or something like that. That would be cool. Oh, he could attack from where he's at.
I think if you just take out this guy, you just win, right? I forget. Like, I don't even have to worry about the other guy. Or about the other piece. Oh, but it's fire too. He's fire too, isn't he? I guess I could kind of block him in. So, yeah. We'll just end it. How's it going? How's it going, reaction? This will finish you. <clears throat> uh, let's see. Shine. Welcome back, reaction. Oh, it's fine, reaction. You don't have to do that, man. But thanks for the compliments ah, on my channel, I guess. <laughs> Did you know that Dan Green actually likes Yu-Gi-Oh! Bridge? Oh, does he? That's funny. I, I admit, like, man, yeah, it was pretty funny. I watched some of it online. Uh, yeah, I guess I did. Did you ever ever yeah, watch uh, like Yu-Gi-Oh! Uh, season Zero? Now you, don't you be losing any other duels, all right? Of course, I won't let you down. Oh yeah. Let's see, do you want the level up? Yes, I want the level up. Oh man, so that yeah, that'd be crazy if you just do like a challenge where not to level up any of your guys. I wonder if it's possible in this game. Yeah, it was pretty good. Oh shoot, okay. Fire Raper, boom. Boom, I guess. Why not? Hey, Yugi! What's wrong, Joey? There's something I forgot to tell you about this tournament. There are five opponents in each area. And if you don't beat them all, you can't move on. I kind of wish they kept the perp- Oh, yeah, yeah, I do remember her. Um, I forget what her name was. Let's look it up. She was the student council girl, right? If I'm... Uh, let's see... Yu-Gi-Oh! Season... Zero... Oh yeah, Miho Nosaka is a major character in Toy Yu-Gi-Oh! Or, uh, no, is that... Yeah, I think that's her. Dude, I, lo I love how in a lot of animes they give the blood type, like, it act like, I know a lot of animes that do that for some reason. Oh, this game came out, I think, in, uh, let's see when it came out. If I'm not mistaken, I think it came out in 2002 or 2003, around there. Yeah, she was a, the waitress, uh, the, the Burger World girl, but yeah. I think that's the one you're talking about, right? But yeah, no, that they should have kept her in. 
I just defeated you, Joey, so I have to defeat four more opponents. And if you right. clear four areas... A new path? What? Like I know. I forget, is Band Keith in here? Band Keith was funny. Well, just keep winning. I'm not sure, did you, like, were you, uh, did you read the manga or know anything about the manga of, like, what actually happens to so poor Band Keith? Are a lot of people that, <laughs> that Joey? like, That's supposedly exactly just disappeared? Yeah, didn't it just bus. disappear? See you later. A new path. I don't know what the new path is, but we're traveling on our own road right now. No matter who we face on this road, we must win, and we'll do it together. Yeah. Man, and I think, yeah, now that I think about it, if you watch the new uh, Shaman King and dub, which I've been doing dub for some reason, but uh, Dan Green's in it, now that I remember. I only read a bit of uh, manga, but yeah, it's a lot darker, which is dope. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Should I go ahead and save it? Yeah, I'll go ahead and save it. Just for my... Yeah. We'll do three. I'll try not to delete one, just because I don't want to lose that data of uh, 2009. I like to keep my gaming journal on my memory cards. <clears throat> oh yeah? Yeah, what, what kind of anime have you seen, Reaction? Have you seen any? I know your sister likes it, but... That's good she does. It's good. A lot of anime is good, man. Let's see, Condemn Warehouse. Go to the next one. Exol. Oh, yeah. His is creepy as fuck. Okay. Let me turn up the music just a little, so then I can hear it. Ta-da! It's me, the man, the legend, Tristan Taylor. Yugi, I may not be as experienced as you, you know, when it comes I, to games. You know, I had a, like a... Tri like anime trivia game that I did once and I had a bunch of like you know with a group of friends you know anime people that I'll, I hang out with and but if you take me lightly, I'm gonna a lot of them were like outlandish questions it was like okay and and like let's say and I've never seen any uh, well, I was trying to think of some questions I made let's just say for in Yu-Gi-Oh in episode 2 when Yu-Gi-Oh was talking to whoever and then who was in the background uh, who was in the background of like uh, episode 4 behind Yu-Gi and what clothes were they wearing just some outlandish question that no one would no ever get and I will use all my and to and, and <laughs> they were just getting mad and I was like you guys if I went to an anime, anime convention and I guarantee you there would be at least one person that could get this right. That is my proof. There has to be one person that could get this right. And oh, yeah, it was just it was uh, just hilarious. But maybe you don't need to use all. Oh yeah, things. Attack on Titan's anime. I, I think I, I saw the first season when it came out. It was pretty good. It wasn't too bad. I, I never watched it after that, but. And then there's another, I, this one I actually did ask, is like in Naruto, the original Naruto series, uh, where during the tuning exams, there was this guy with a mustache and glasses. What was his name in occupation? And that is actual, like, that's an actual, like, trivia question. Uh, he was like a Genin, and he was like age 24, and it was so stupid that they actually had that information. I was like, why would they care? Uh, I'm going to put him up here. Yes. But I guarantee you there'll be someone that knows all the answers to the questions I set up. Oh shoot, there's permadeath in here? Permadeath? Or is there a way to heal them? Oh damn, I didn't know that. Okay. One flame viper. 
fire grass, fire reaper, fire reaper. Uh, that was time, but we'll do this one. Let's see. Coming of uh, she is okay. I have to be more strategic on this one, I see. Well, it's not really permadeath, but they can't be used for one. Oh, okay, okay. That makes sense. That works. Okay, we'll place the fire up here. Uh, I think it has to be. Okay, we can do it here. Manual place. Let's look at the map. Is he way over here? He hasn't placed his stuff yet, has Okay. He's grass type, huh? Or wind? One of the two? It's time to get this party started! Oh, wood. Wood. That's what it was. So he's already at a natural disadvantage since I'm fire. Well, I have one electric guy. But... <laughs> he's got wood. <laughs> in my turn. Let me see. How should I attack? gonna unhatch all my stuff or summon all my stuff I mean once I do that it won't be too bad I don't think yeah and I'm just gonna see where he starts moving to you know realistically I could just wait till he comes and then I could just blitz his guys and then that would take a while because I think he's gonna come circle all around so yeah Or I could just take half of my guys and go one way and half the other way, but I think I just might. I mean, it's risky because then he could just attack my guys, but... Let's see, how far is it? Okay, so he's already here. But I bet he's going to take uh, big jumps and stuff, so I'm just going to move here. One turn. Let him just come for. Let him jump into the trap. Huh. 
Interesting. Okay, we're just gonna... How far can he move? Is it only... Oh, it's one at a time. Jeez, that's gonna take a while. Man, now he's retreating. That, oh, she's okay. So he's just gonna come around. So I'll just have to keep these three. Cause he's just gonna go for my uh, king. Oh shoot! This is poi all poisonous too, huh? Take damage there. I can't let that happen. Make your move, Tristan boy. <laughs> yeah, he is using set tactics. I noticed that. I thought he was just gonna come around, but no, he's trying to stall. But it's fine now. Damn, I still have to go that far just to attack. I'll go ahead and do it. Was your first, but it will definitely not be your last. Whoa, not bad, Yugi. Yeah, we'll just put him back there. He doesn't need to get hurt anymore. Oh, this is a mirror match. That's stupid. Oh yeah, and Ben Keith is in the game, but oh okay, yeah. I think he's like the fifth, fourth one, right? This is all a duelist kingdom uh, and people characters. Remember, Yugi, you hurt my monster. I'm gonna repay you ten times back. Did you ever uh, watch the uh, the newest Yu-Gi-Oh movie? The sh oh, sh I forget the name of it, but uh, I tried to, man. I fell asleep, and I don't know, it just didn't seem that interesting. But Clark. 
clearly I need to move this guy over here so when that other guy comes, we can just get rid of him. That's crazy that they put Joey before Tristan because Tristan wasn't like a, he was a worse duelist than uh, uh, Joey was, wasn't he? Oh, the last Yu Gi Oh movie was surprisingly good. I went into it with well, okay, okay. So I could be because I was already so tired, and I'll have to rewatch and give it a shot. I mean, the animation seemed pretty. I like how they didn't change the art style, but the animation was pretty plain. Just yeah, I, I need to rewatch it then. Because son of a bitch. If, if then then I'm monster. Monster. I'll use all my skills until the victory. See where this guy can attack at. I'm gonna lose the electric guy anyways, but either way I'm just gonna go around and not take the damage for him and wait for that the caterpillar to come. But the electric guy's pretty much good as dead, so. It was nice to see the game back, and it was not censored to the- Okay, so yeah, I definitely need to watch it then. So, again. I think it's the best Yu-Gi-Oh movie. Oh, okay. I won't be surprised. I think the only one that I saw was the Pyramid of Light back in the day. I think I actually went to theaters to see that now that I think about it. But yeah, I can't remember what you, much about it. I know they had the Sphinx and uh, the other creatures and whatnot. But yeah, I don't think most of the movies were good. So. Like, I never really... I think I watched a few episodes of GX, but I never really got past that after. You know, I know the GX game was good. I don't have... I don't think I have it anymore. But, I, well, I don't think I ever had it. I think my brother had it, and I played it, and it, it was pretty fun. The Season Zero movie is neat, but kind of just okay. The Pyramid of Light was kind of mediocre, and bonds between time and... It, had its moments, but still kind of okay. Yeah, I think like Which the said, the only one I think I've seen was Pyramid of Light. I don't think I've seen any of the others. So, I I know the anime like they just keep going, and there's that new one that uh, it's not Arc 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 V, which is a uh, I I but there's one after that. I don't know what's called, but they changed. They really changed the anime style or uh, their animation style on that, which was different. Hey, welcome back, Reaction. Let's see, that's fine. Maybe my electric guy can get back to... Yeah, 
he would be fine. Yeah, like that's gonna help. You just postpone the inevitable. No, I don't care, man. Either way, I'm gonna probably be doing it myself anyways, you know? So, I couldn't care less. <laughs> I mean, either way, it's, it's... Oh, shit, I do need to get out of the fire pit. Okay. No, I really don't get sad or anything. I'm still new, like I said, so I don't expect, like, that many views to be enough, you know? And plus, I stream when I want, so it's like I don't have a set schedule, so... Yu-Gi-Oh! 7s, I think. I, I don't know, after 5Ds, it got too stupid for me. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, 5Ds with the motorcycles, I, you know, I think I saw, like, one episode. I thought the dual discs that they had were cool, like, some of them. Uh, I know I used to have the... Seal of Ori Calcos, uh, dual disc. I don't know what ever happened to that one, but. I'm just gonna protect my king for now and then let him make the move. Like, I'd say for, like, let's say if we're talking about, like, my favorite archetype, which would be, like, types would be... Man, I... You know, Dark Magician's still good. Oh, the seal or, or, of Orcalcos was the interesting tale of archetype, we'll say. Yeah, yeah, it was. Uh, the card actually looks pretty good. The design of the card looks pretty badass, too. And... Nah, it doesn't matter. Now I'm going to have to go all the way freaking around just to kill him. It's like Pokemon, the last time I actually watched Pokemon was, uh, so let me see, the very last episode I watched of Pokemon was when they had the episode of the unknown, and I was like, this is getting too crazy, I don't understand it, you know, <laughs> I was like, it just keeps going on and on, and you know, but until then, I, I, I don't know what episode that is, I or, am or anything, but then I, freeway. I don't no know, was that Pokemon Advance? I don't, see, I don't know. It's like, I know I watched some of the other ones when they had the different intros and they got rid of Brock and brought the other guy in. I, see, I don't know. Uh, this game, I've been streaming for about two hours now, so it's not too, I mean, this game, I don't know how long. Uh, maybe an hour. But, uh, I knew so, I but overall, I've been streaming for about two hours. So. Keep it up, you I'm counting on you. Thank you, Tristan. Oh, okay, so I don't have to destroy his king. Yeah. I guess he can't fight. That's good. They got rid of that. Yeah. Oh, man, Bio. Uh, I know we talked about this, like, a long time ago, or a little bit, in your chat, but, um... If... Have you, you, have you seen the Shaman King uh, series yet? Or... Because I, I told you originally... You might wait till the original, but, and I agree, the, the new one is way better than the original. Pokemon is another that I don't care to watch much unless it's the old, yeah, I agree. I I not know where I would, you know, I think the first, like, Indigo, was it, or, or Kanto, Kanto, yeah, I saw Kanto, uh, was good, and, you know. Select enemy. Which one shall I take? <sighs> T 
Tate Moth, MP. No, let's. Oh, okay. I, yeah, if, if you do watch it, you might as well watch the new one because it's actually direct off the manga instead of. Because the other, the old one, I really love the old one, but this one, like, so far is way better, you know, because it's like. It's, they, they kept with the art style and they didn't really change. Like, Baki, man. Bucky still pisses me off of how they change the art style and whatnot, but, uh, let's see. Shaman King is pretty, the new one's pretty good. The re, or the breed done of it. It's not done yet, but if you do watch it, definitely watch the new one over the old one, you know. Yeah, yeah. I'll take this. No, I already have electric. I don't even think I have wood. Uh, I guess I could take either. You know. No, I need more cheap guys. You know, because then I can have more. I don't know why, but I always got hunter, hunter, hunter x hunter vibes from it. Okay, that's fair, in a way. Um, in a way, it kind of is because they go like it is kind of shown in you know, and it is a shonen, I guess you could say. But if if you would. Think of it like think of it like JoJo like a JoJo mixed with Persona. Uh, that'll probably be a better way to explain it because it's it's kind of like a mix between both in a way. But you know because they're I guess they're in school, but it's not as like bizarre or crazy as J JoJo gets. And uh, so yeah, I would say that's a good explanation. Or even yeah, so it's kind of like a in between that, you know. That's the best. I, that's the best way I could explain it. Even though, and it, and it doesn't get too crazy. I feel like they explain stuff, you know. Like JoJo, I I do like JoJo to a certain extent, but I haven't watched past four. I think you know. So I still got five and six ones out now, or something like that. To be fair, I've never seen Hunter Hunter, but it's another one. I was oh man, you know I loved Hunter. I I, I watched the remake of that one too. I think 2011. I saw the original, like not the full thing, but I, I did see quite a bit of the original. So, uh, but yeah. Uh, let me see. I, a lot, the old one had a lot of filler in it, from what I'm told. I never read the manga, but I'm just going off what my buddies have told me, and they said there's a lot of filler. But they also say I should still go back and watch the original. So, I mean, I'm not saying it's bad, but both of them are, from what I hear, the, I know 2011 was really good, uh, but I need to go back and watch the original as well, so. They say it's worth watching as well, so. I just like Hunter x Hunter, without any spoilers or anything, or any ruins, is that, like, is that a lot of... It's like very creative on how they could win because it's not like strictly power based, it's like strictly strategic based on how you use your powers and all that stuff. So that's what I like about it. Okay, the, the original has a cool vibe, but I either. Uh, oh, okay. I, yeah, it was never finished, the original. But you could say technically this one, 2011, is still being written, so. Either way, it's like, it's not story finished, but it's, this this whole arc is finished, if that makes sense, you know? Like, there's a different arc that's going to start, and, but, so, I mean, but, I'm trying not to do, like, any spoilers or anything, but it's like, yeah, it's going to be a brand new arc kind of thing, you know, so. But you could watch all episodes of 2011, and the story would be finished of what what is done with the manga so far, if that makes sense. It's like Dragon Ball Z, like I actually really do like the original Dragon Ball Z. I did watch a little bit of Super, I never finished Super, but the thing that, you know, like the power scaling in Super, 
was it just or even just later on it just gets ridiculous and of course you had Toriyama come out and say well it should have never even gone this way. well people say he said that. I'm not sure if he actually said that but so I don't know it, it's like uh, as they say like it it should have been done with the Fraser saga which if that was it you know I'd say yeah it, it was probably some you know really great but when you just drag stuff on it just kind of gets worn thin I guess Oh, I guess it's going to get harder, man. Uh, so let's... He uses... Let's see. I don't know. I should think this out a little bit better than just picking randoms. I should choose some fodder. So he these four. But let's see. 60. 60. Oh, damn. So I guess you... You know, I guess that's fine. It's just a square, okay. unless he pops up here. So I guess he's going to be back here somewhere. So and it's same like if, if it's the same thing with like Naruto. It's like if they would have ended it with like, or if they would have not brought more random characters in for power scaling, it would have been a lot better. But if they would have probably just ended with like the Akatsuki or something, they would have been a lot better. Because then if you just like keep going, the power scaling gets ridiculous in almost anything. Because it's like, well, you this guy's like 50% stronger, or he has to be way stronger. He can't be weaker, you know, you have to push it to the limit, so... I'm actually watching Bleach right now because they're gonna redo the or continue Bleach. Oh yeah, yeah. It it kind of does go downhill till Pain after Pain, you know? Because Pain was cool. Like the fight between him and Naruto was good. Uh, but yeah, there was a lot of downhills in the series. Like when the war starts, it gets good again for a while, and then it kind of just drags on, and then after that, it just gets crazy. It's like DBC. Dragon Ball power scaling and stuff. But I'm watching Bleach and like people say, oh, it's way better than Naruto because of the power scaling. I call BS on that, but you know, I'm not sure if you've ever seen Bleach. Because it's like, yeah, I don't know, it's very. I don't know. It's my turn. Yu Yu Hakusho was good too. Uh, I need to finish it. I'm on like episode 86 and I've been on episode like 86 for years. I just never finished it because honestly tournament arcs get boring for me and a lot a lot of times if they're not done right because it's like oh this guy's gonna fight this guy also the whole thing about bringing back everyone he killed was so uh oh yeah 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 i think so too man if they would have made it left it where it was permanent because the thing about dragon ball 2 you know bring that up is like if, if someone dies in Dragon Ball, no one cares because you could just bring him back. Oh, my over. But think about it. Yeah, it, it's it's good. I like some of the fights. Um, I'm going to finish I'm on like episode 65 or 66, so it's going to take me a while to actually finish watching it. Uh, but it's like you have these guys that are just like, you know, the Soul Reapers that get freaking like, oh, you have like, uh, or Rukia's brother that you think is going to OP, but then you have Aizen that's like 100 times stronger than him, and then you have the guy that's before him with the spike here that's, uh, and it's like, it's like every enemy and every Soul Reaper is like 50% or 100 times stronger than, or it's just like, it's ridiculous, you know? It's like, at least with, I think that's why I like Hunter Hunter, like it's probably one of my favorite shonens because you have guys that, oh, like, this guy's, like, physically the strongest, but mentally and strategically he's just stupid, so he can't... I know having Kakashi being dead would be sad, but it would be... Oh, yes, it would. I, I definitely think so. I think that's why, like, the flashbacks in Naruto are really good, because, one, they can't bring him back, 
and then you get like uh, you get like sentimental after over the characters because they're dead. You can't bring them back. There's nothing. Well, I guess they did bring them back with like well as zombie types or whatever. But I don't know. It's like I said it could. Oh wow, he's gonna circle me around, huh? Okay, how should I do this? I'm just gonna go all for it and hope for the best. Damn, that was not good. I thought I was gonna do more than that. But, I don't know. I'm hoping I really get into Bleach. In One Piece, I really do like One Piece a lot, but there's way too much uh, comedy relief in it, I personally think. But there's a lot of characters I really do like, like Akainu, Do Flamingo. Uh, of course, when you watch Shonen's, almost every Shonen that I watch, I never like the main protagonist. Or, as my main favorite character. I always like the sub characters, I always like the villains more, I always think how to get out of it. like for example Yu-Gi-Oh! Like I always prefer Kaiba or Pegasus or even you know, I like other side characters more than uh more than the main characters, you know, so uh, we'll keep him there for now. Alright, nope, we don't want to move him. He's just in the way now, so we'll move him right there. No, I don't want to turn. Oh, right, I can't move anymore. Fuck, oh well. Yeah, it's like, uh, same when, uh,. I'm not sure if you actually finished, but my guy, he should have, they should have just killed him off too when he fought Madra, you know? Like, if they, at the end, they should have just definitely gone full, you know, when, when someone dies, you know, they should just make the impact what it is, you know? I might, I might not win this one, I, I think I jumped in too fast. I did jump in too fast. I might lose him. Yep, that was stupid. Like, let's say... I don't know. So, I still need to watch Bubblegum Crisis because I bought it on Blu-ray. Like, when was that? Like a year ago? And I still need to find a time just to sit down and watch. Because you, I know you really love it bio and I know a lot of people that I know love it it just I don't know why there's when when something gets on my backlog to watch it just ends up there for years before I finally watch it which is sad I need to get better at doing that but crap I'm gonna die man well, he's gonna attack me, but I'll, I'll take him out next turn, but still. I made that bad move last turn. I do like the space station level, though. I always did like Duke Devlin anyways. Oh, uh... Oh, for the show that I need to watch, uh... Oh, no, I, I need to watch Bubblegum Crisis, if, if, if you didn't hear that. Um, I, I, like I said, I bought it for on Blu-ray for like a year ago, maybe two years ago now. And I still have yet to watch it, because it's like... I'm still watching um, Sakura Wars, the original series, like the original one, and that one's kind of hard to, you could tell the pacing in that one's kind of hard to watch, but uh, overall it's, it's, it's good. I like the animation, but uh, there's some, like the pacing on it's kind of iffy, you know? 
How am I always off? What the hell? Art. Oh shoot. Oh, is it short? How many episodes are there? Or is it? Or is it more like a OVA? You know? Or is it like? 10, 12 episodes, you know? I wouldn't mind if it was like 24 episodes because, I, like I said, I know I'm gonna love it, it's just the matter of watching it and enjoying it, so. Don't think you won yet! And I think it's because I also wanted to do like a review on it or something, a discussion. You know, there's some stuff I do want to do like a review discussion type videos and stuff. And so I always put it off because I'm like, well, I'm not sure. Dude, one health? That's BS. Okay. I guess I should have been paying attention. It would have told me it would have. But that's my own fault. Now I gotta waste it on this guy. Oh yeah, yeah, I did like, uh, probably for wrestling, I did like, well for the games, let's do with that first. For wrestling, I really did like the Smackdown vs. Raw series, Shut Your Mouth, uh, Here Comes, I didn't, I didn't really play Here Comes the Plane, but I did Shut Your Mouth, because they were like a year apart, and Shut Your Mouth was the one that I got. So I played Shut Your Mouth like 2002 to like 2005, that was one of my favorite ones, and then I got into the Smackdown vs. Raw series and all that, but... I watched uh, basically Attitude Era a little bit all the way to Ruthless Aggression. I did watch some like TNA stuff and oh yeah, those are my favorite man. They're still my favorite. Like you know, I don't think I'm not sure if I'm gonna try to get one of the new like the new one that's coming out because they say they fixed a lot of shit. But uh, I even watched AEW like last year and some AEW stuff. It, it reminded me really of the Ruthless Aggression or even late uh, Attitude Era stuff, you know, just the way they were doing stuff. And, uh, but, no, I do like it. I do like a lot of wrestling stuff. Um, I don't really watch it now, but because I don't really have, like, cable per se, and it's hard to find. I mean, I guess I could subscribe to some stuff and get it, but uh, I'm just getting my turn. But I know I do, man. Like, I do like it. I I listen to some like podcasts and stuff. I say the newer ones are only worth. Okay, yeah, yeah. I definitely think that would be good too. Uh, once once I get like your Twitter and stuff, I won't say for sure it in the chat, but you know because you don't know who you who's watching and stuff. But oh, does it? Oh yeah, wrestling does suck, but. Uh, I definitely need to find like a good site for mods, and plus I need to like we could work out that deal about getting Gungrave and whatnot and stuff. And I, I, so I'll definitely find you on Twitter or something. That was a lot of damage, but it survived. Son of a bitch, you fucker! I mean, I'm I'm gonna be fine because he has two guys left, but it's gonna be rough. This is what's gonna let me turn this duel upside down. Yeah, because you got rid of one guy. Which... Yeah, let me know yours. And, oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I guess I could technically share it. Uh, let me do that with this building. Definitely do that. Let me... brings me one step closer to being the new king of games.
what? Not bad. Had a phone call. If you can't stop my easy attack, oh, is it? Um, yeah, yeah, I had to. Um, I got a phone call, so. <laughs> or maybe it was on me. Oh, okay. <laughs> maybe I muted it when I was texting something, you know? So, or. So, okay, I think it's all fixed now. I see it going right now. So. Yeah. I don't know. I, I need to choose a different hotkey to mute it because I put in and anytime I look stuff up I mute it I mute it I found that out yesterday when I was doing ring or was it Ringo or something I don't know I mute stuff on accident but oh well like the first 15 minutes I was freaking muted <laughs> once I look something up and type in it just mutes it oh okay awesome sounds good yeah yeah I don't know what happened to the King Cole. see I had the King Cole games the one that you see I guess they redid it because I haven't used that one since like 2009. And I guess if you're inactive, they'll, they'll like redo it. And if you don't log in, they'll probably just eventually delete it. I don't know how it works, but. Oh, what did, uh, okay, let's see, capabilities. I'm not sure if I'm gonna do good, man. Yeah, I think I lost this one, man. Jeez, I, man, yeah, I definitely lost this one. destroy that he's gonna go straight for my guy now <laughs> oh well oh that's how the camera chain view changed okay but yeah I was going to say have you heard of stardom wrestling let me see I'm not sure if I have let me look at it is it pretty new or is it Is it part of uh, Fire Pro Wrestling or no?
I d yeah, I don't think I have heard. I, I've heard of Fire Pro Wrestling, but I'm not sure if like that's the same. Like, no, I haven't heard of Stardom Wrestling. Huh. But I've heard of like Fire Pro Wrestling. There's a lot of good Japanese promotion. Okay, it's Japanese brand with all the women and so much. Oh, okay. I've seen some of the Japanese ones with the women. Like after I saw AEW with uh, Yuka Sakazaki and Shiho and a bunch of others, I found out. Okay, okay, I'll have to look more into it, um, because yeah, if you could definitely, uh, send me that or, in Twitter or something there and whatnot, I'll look more into it, because I did see some, I forget what the company and the brands are, but I know it wasn't called Stardom, so, uh, yeah, so, man, so, those, the Japanese wrestling, man, way better in a lot of times, you know, so. I think I'll probably lose, and I'll probably have to call quits because I have to go do something in a bit, but, you know, there's no rush for me to end it, this stream, but I'm just, uh, if I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die and run away, I guess. <laughs> but no, I'll definitely, uh, message you on Twitter, man, because... At least I'm gonna take down his Karibo and maybe a Scorpion. Unless he just goes for the kill this turn. Which would be stupid not to just go for the kill, but... Who knows, maybe I can pull it off. I think I might be able to pull it off. Because if he attacks and doesn't go for my main guy... I... Uh, I don't know, we'll see what happens. I took a lot of damage from that one attack! Yeah, my picture is... Oh, okay. Sounds good, yeah. Well, he took out my guy instead of just finishing me off. going for the the torture kill man he's not even just gonna finish my thing off at least I'll get his Karibo killed regardless. If I had my third guy, maybe I could take out two, but... Death by Kariba would be... Yeah, it would be, but thankfully it's gonna be the death by the Scorpion. <laughs> At least I got rid of the Kariba. Say, if I'm gonna go down, I'm gonna go down with some damage. Now things are getting fun. How far is his thing? Yeah, it doesn't matter. Can you click to see where they can move? Let's see. Uh, I don't think you can. If I recall, he could just run in and... This thing's not gonna do any damage to this guy, probably. Yeah, 72, that's like nothing. That's why you got rid of my other gun. Cause I, at least I would have been able to take down a scorpion, and then I might have actually won after that. I'm not worried. It's not like you destroyed my. Let's see. I won't surrender. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha. 
You'll never defeat mine! Why did he back up? Well, I guess he's gonna destroy this guy anyways, but... That's like risk... Oh, I guess the duck took some damage earlier, but still. Dude, he might just fuck himself over now I think about it. If I get rid of this scorpion next turn with my duck, he's gonna hit me next turn and then I'll hit him. We'll see what happens. I might be able to win it by his stupidity. Oh, that's right on the dot, man. That's crazy. What the heck? He had three? Or he attacked first, then moved. What the heck? Oh, he attacked with the one he backed up with. Dang. This was a good match. I could never beat Kaiba in this game. Oh, really? I think I beat it w once, you know? Is Kaiba the second, the last guy, or is he the main guy? I forget. It's been like, like I said, it's been like a long time since I played, but I'm pretty sure I beat this game. close to then also Merrick oh okay I know I've got the Merrick so I I'm pretty sure I mean we I can look at my old save file and see where well I'm not sure when if I started or where who was that last time I'll probably do that after this just to see but you could see how they attack because then if I move in the right direction he could either go for let's see because if you know there's sometimes you could like oh okay it says okay it says right there move up to an attack to okay so okay so he could move so let's see he moves here but he attacks diagonally but then he could also move to here. So if I move here, I'm at diagonal, so I'm at dis huge disadvantage anyways. Uh, but if I... Okay, let's see. Move up to attack diagonal. So if he moves back to, he could attack here. But if he moves one, he could attack here. But he's blocked here, so if I move, but it doesn't matter. Ah, uh, she's, but if he. Let's see. He could just move one. I'm gonna try here. Yeah, yeah, I ended up seeing that. I don't know how I missed that <laughs> in the beginning. I don't know if that's. I might have misjudged it, but let's see what he's gonna do. try to go for that, but then doesn't matter, you know, unless
I mean, I think he's gonna do 83 damage anyways, but at least I got one attack on him, at least. And if I didn't make that stupid first move, I know where I fucked up from the very beginning. It would have probably been there. <laughs> if I take Let's see. I'm at 82, so I think he did 83 damage last turn. I'm not, I'm not sure, sure what, what I should, should do, do next. next. Give up, bitch. Why would he just fuck? You know, he. Oh, fuck you. How much damage did he have? He did 82 direct. That's so stupid. So if I was like, uh. 83, I would have survived. Man, that was close either way. I mean, I fucked up and I knew exactly where I fucked up in the end, so that was my own fault for not taking him seriously. Yeah, yeah, I lost. Big bluff. <laughs> it's clear for everyone to see who's the better duelist. I, dude, I remember when they did try to make uh, dungeon dice monsters like the game, like the physical game. I won. I took down Yugi. You won, dude. Fair and square. <laughs> that, that was an excellent, excellent duel. duel. I, I didn't know who was going to win for a while. But, but that, that doesn't, doesn't matter because, because a win is a win. I wonder if he says that, like, even if he just wiped the floor and I never got a hit on him. I wonder if he says, Come I won't, I'm not, I don't know, who, you know, I wonder if he says the same exact thing. Oh, well. That sucks. I do want to load it to see where I was in the last thing. No, let's not. I want to load it to see where I was uh, w when I saved it last time. So let's see. Load. Let's see. Oh. Devil baby. Huh. Interesting name. Curious to see where I was. Oh, what the? Well, I'll be. I was in the same freaking spot. Unless, did I save it over? No, I can't know. <laughs> what a name, yeah. Oh, well. Well. It was fun. I'll probably head end the stream here, man. I'll definitely message you um, over Twitter bio and whatnot and get that situated. I hope you guys enjoyed and whoever was here, else was here. I know there was someone else here, but they seemed to be uh, lurking. So, uh, well, I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time.